and none of them work none of them work and none of them really work hello guys and welcome to the channel today in this video i'm going to show you a quick tip how you can fix microsoft store if it doesn't work for some reason and you're trying to get into the microsoft store but it's saying it's not working and it says try again later which is not really good because it doesn't explain what is the problem and why it's not working and if you have already tried other things as well to fix it but it still doesn't work this is going to be a completely different tip so stay tuned and let's get started so this is the issue that i was actually facing myself and I actually ran into this problem when i needed to update lenovo vantage from my laptop and because you can only download it through the microsoft store i was unable to update it and this was causing issues because i couldn't start lenovo vantage and I couldn't update it because Microsoft Store wasn't working and you cannot just go to their website and download the app and run it because you have to do it through the Microsoft Store which didn't work. I have checked a few videos but nobody showed this tip. So I was looking for different solutions and maybe like other people as well I have already looked through different ways how to fix it and none of them work. Neither resetting the store nor running commands through the PowerShell or changing the time zone logging into your account or changing different account none of that worked and maybe it's a good solution for some cases but not in this case because i've already tried all those methods and none of them really worked and i don't think you really have to go through the powershell to make the microsoft store work well because not everybody is advanced user and they know how to use PowerShell and you shouldn't have to go through the PowerShell to make the Microsoft Store work. But I have found a way to fix it and actually it was very simple. So one day I was thinking what could it be? And I'm using VPN myself to have a secure connection to the internet and I thought I'm gonna try to disable VPN and see if it's gonna work. And it did. I was actually so surprised that having VPN disabled actually opened the store right away. And I was thinking why they couldn't just specify the issue in the first place. They don't specify anything, they just say try again later. Okay, well you try again later, it doesn't work. You say, they say again, try again later. Like why can't they just explain what was the issue and how to fix it instead of just saying try again later. It doesn't really help much. Well if they know that the connection from the VPN doesn't allow you to enter the Microsoft Store and they know that's the issue, why they just tell you turn off your VPN or use a different connection or something like that. Why would they make it so difficult? They put some error code and if you search it online, it doesn't give you any solutions for that code. So who's that code for? And yeah, if you guys are facing the same issue where your Microsoft Store doesn't work and you have already tried all the different methods online, like you tried to reset the store, you tried to run some commands via the PowerShell and uh, all other things, adjust the time zone, another million things that you have already tried just try to turn off your vpn and if you tried it and this worked for you please give this video a like if you're new to the channel please take a second to click the subscribe button and if you have any comments questions drop them down in the comment section below i hope this video was helpful to you but this is it for now i hope you have a nice day see you soon bye bye